Nothing to report, sir. Too winchy. Ah, yes. Winchiness. A point I had not considered. Remember how to carry your shields. You're not hiding, you're holding. Otherwise, it's useless. Blackwall. Warden Blackwall. You're not. How do you know my name? Who sent. Ah! <laughs> That's it. Help or get out. We're dealing with these idiots first. Conscripts, here they come. Good work, conscripts. Even if this shouldn't have happened, they could have... Well, thieves are made, not born. Take back what they stole. Go back to your families. You saved yourselves. You're no farmer. Why do you know my name? Who are you? I'm here investigating Grey Wardens for the Inquisition. We're seeing if their disappearance has anything to do with the murder of the Divine. Maker's balls. The Wardens and the Divine. That can't... No, you're asking so you don't really know. First off, I didn't know they disappeared. But we do that, right? No more blight, job done. Wardens are the first thing forgotten. But one thing I'll tell you, no Warden killed the Divine. Our purpose isn't political. So where are the rest of you? I haven't seen any Wardens for months. I travel alone, recruiting. Not much interest because the Archdemon is a decade dead, and no need to conscript because there's no blight coming. Treaties give Wardens the right to take what we need, who we need. These idiots forced this fight, so I conscripted their victims. 
They had to do what I said, so I told them to stand. Next time, they won't need me. Grey Wardens can inspire, make you better than you think you are. Why haven't you gone missing like the rest of them? Well, maybe I was going to. Or maybe there's a new directive, but a runner got lost or something. My job was to recruit on my own. Plan to stay that way for months, years. It's been a pleasure, Warden Blackwall, but this didn't help at all. Inquisition, agent. Did you say? Hold a moment. The Divine is dead and the sky is torn. Events like these, thinking we're absent is almost as bad as thinking we're involved. If you're trying to put things right, maybe you need a Warden. Maybe you need me. Warden Blackwall, the Inquisition accepts your offer. Good to hear. We both need to know what's going on. And perhaps I've been keeping to myself for too long. This Warden walks with the Inquisition. We don't know what these rifts can do. That one appeared to alter the time around it. We spread word the Inquisition was coming. But you should know that no one here was expecting us. No one? Not even Grand Enchanter Fiona? If she was, she hasn't told anyone. We've arranged use of the tavern for the negotiations. Agents of the Inquisition, my apologies. Magister Alexius is in charge now, but hasn't yet arrived. He's expected shortly. You can speak with the former Grand Enchanter in the meantime. The Vale is weaker here than in Haven. And not merely weak, but altered in a way I have not seen. We should talk. Seeker, you initially believed our Herald of Andraste was involved in the attack on the Conclave, yes? I did. The evidence seemed damning, given the lack of an alternative. Yet you changed your mind. You also heard the voices at the temple. Is it so surprising I listened to them? Sadly, yes. Too few invested with authority possess the courage to alter their course. They fear the appearance of weakness. The truth is more important than my reputation. And anyone wishing to accuse me of weakness is welcome to try. We should look around.
Welcome, agents of the Inquisition. What has brought you to Redcliffe? We're here because of your invitation back in Val Royaux. You must be mistaken. I haven't been to Val Royaux since before the Conclave. There is no mistake. While the Templars were leaving, you came to Val Royaux and asked me here. The Templars left Val Royaux? Where did they go? That sounds... Why does that sound so strange? Whoever, or whatever, brought you here? The situation has changed. The Free Mages have already pledged themselves to the service of the Tevinta Imperium. An alliance with Tevinta? Do you not fear all of Thedas turning against you? I understand that you are afraid, but you deserve better than slavery to Tevinta. As one indenture to a Magister, I no longer have the authority to negotiate with you. Very well. Who's in charge now? Welcome, my friends. I apologize for not greeting you earlier. Agents of the Inquisition, allow me to introduce Magister Girion Alexius. The Southern Mages are under my command. And you are the survivor, yes? The one from the Fade? Interesting. If you're leading the mages now, then let's talk. I'm sure we can come to an arrangement. It is always a pleasure to meet a reasonable man. Felix, would you send for a scribe, please? Pardon my manners. My son Felix, friends. I am not surprised you're here. Containing the breach is not a feat that many could even attempt. There is no telling how many mages would be needed for such an endeavor. Ambitious, indeed. Does that mean you'll lend your mages to our cause? There will have to be. Felix. My lord, I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Are you all right? I'm fine, father. Come, I'll get your powders. Please excuse me, friends. We will have to continue this another time. Fiona, I require your assistance back at the castle. I don't mean to trouble everyone. I shall send word to the Inquisition. We will conclude this business at a later date. Come to the Chantry. You are in danger. Well, aren't we secretive? <laughs> We'll be careful, but we need to figure out what's going on here. Inquisition, huh? I wish to Holy Andraste you'd gotten here sooner. These two winters make my shoulder bleed itch. How did the Grand Enchanter end up working with Tevinter? One minute, we were bracing for the Templars to attack. The next, we had a Magister ally. It was a stroke of luck that's given us an edge, in a way, out of the frying pan. You're not happy with this new alliance? Something's not right about that lot. They're not like us, magic or no. I'd rather count myself among decent folk than stand with Magisters. Goodbye. Be careful. The Tevinters likely aren't happy you're asking questions.
Make us speed you, my child. Good. You're finally here. Now help me close this, would you? work exactly <laughs> you don't even know do you you just wiggle your fingers and boom rift closes who are you ah getting ahead of myself again i see dorian of house parvis most recently of minrathus how do you do another tevinta be cautious with this one suspicious friends you have here magister alexius was once my mentor so my assistance should be valuable, as I'm sure you can imagine. You're betraying your mentor because... Alexius was my mentor. Meaning he's not any longer, not for some time. Look, you must know there's danger. That should be obvious even without the note. Let's start with Alexius claiming the allegiance of the mage rebels out from under you. As if by magic, yes? Which is exactly right. To reach Redcliffe, before the Inquisition, Alexius distorted time itself. I've never heard of magic that controls time. That is fascinating, if true, and almost certainly dangerous. The rift you closed here. You saw how it twisted time around itself, sped some things up and slowed others down. Soon, there will be more like it, and they'll appear further and further away from Redcliffe. The magic Alexius is using is wildly unstable, and it's unraveling the world. I'd like more proof than magical time control. Go with it. I know what I'm talking about. I helped develop this magic. When I was still his apprentice, it was pure theory. Alexius could never get it to work. What I don't understand is why he's doing it. Ripping time to shreds just to gain a few hundred lackeys? He didn't do it for them. Took you long enough. Is he getting suspicious? No, but I shouldn't have played the illness card. I thought he'd be fussing over me all day. My father's joined a cult, to Vinta Supremacists. They call themselves Venatori. And I can tell you one thing. Whatever he's done for them, he's done it to get to you. All this for me. And here I didn't get Alexius anything. Send him a fruit basket. Everyone loves those. You know you're his target. Expecting the trap is the first step in turning it to your advantage. I can't stay in Redcliffe. Alexius doesn't know I'm here, and I want to keep it that way for now. But whenever you're ready to deal with him, I want to be there. I'll be in touch. Oh, and Felix, try not to get yourself killed. There are worse things than dying, Dorian. <laughs>